if if there is resourcing available for creating a brand around it, a theme of some kind, whether it be a story or a character, something that is familiar, recognizable visually and experientially is something that's always good. Relatively easy to implement. There is, you know, of course a budget required, but for example, if you can create a a character that you introduce as part of an awareness campaign to get that buy-in initially as part of your holistic experience. And then that character or characters becomes part of the experience within maybe a scenario-based learning or, you know, the Microsoft paperclip that might tap, <laughs> give you tips yeah. and guidance or coaching along the way. It's one way to uh, keep that familiarity going through. And then to continue that, to answer your question, would be to keep that experience alive. And if it's something character-based like that, which I always advocate for, because um, I'm a fan of storytelling, but if it's something like that, then you just, you infuse it into the culture in such a way where it becomes something that's familiar and it becomes something that... Um, is tied to whatever that initiative is. So if it's something boring like compliance and you tie this character to it, who can be relatable, who might even be also rolling their eyes about it, you know, as we all do with compliance. Um, and then they become relatable and it becomes something that can be fun, dare I say. <laughs> so